hogs on the mob planting purple seeds. Baltimore Ravens coat, purple trim, big body, old school for low. Purple rim, seven seven cutty, black with the purple stripe. Right. What's good, family? So your boy just got uh, back from work. So I see some little things been happening uh, while I was on my way home. Now Michael Gallup is is visiting the Ravens. Now I'm kind of in the middle of this. Um, the good news, they're they're doing something, but it's like no splash. But I'm kind of just like in the middle. I I I don't know. Um, I don't know, y'all. To be real with y'all, y'all know I'm gonna be real with it. Um, when I first saw the news, I was just kind of like, okay. I see some people was like, no, I don't like it. But then I'm like. Give me a name, like, like if he visiting, I'm like, cool. His stats from last year: thirty-four receptions, four hundred eighteen yards, two TDs. And I'm looking at some of his games. He's a cowgirl, cow. Well, he was a cowgirl, cowboy. I'm looking at some of the games, like their last game against Washington in the regular season. Zero targets. Zero targets. No, two targets, zero receptions. Only two targets. The game against Detroit, which Detroit won. I watched it. It was beautiful. Zero targets. Like his most targets I see is when the Cowboys played the Chargers. He has 10. Beginning of the season, his targets 2, 2, 7, 6, 5, 10, 3, 3, 2, 5. Kind of went up and down. But the postseason... Gets Green Bay, which they lost. Six targets, six receptions, 103 yards. He did good. It's like, was Dak not giving him a chance? Was the offense coordinator not really giving him a chance? So that's why I'm kind of on the, the rocks with him. Because he used to burn people. He used to burn, do a little, little uh, streak, little routes. Well, he was cooking them. Now, another person I would like for them to check out, I don't know if it'll ever happen, because Michael Gallup is, do they show the age on here? I think he's like 27, 20, uh, he's 28 years old. I would like them to check out Tyler Boyd if, if they can, if, if he's willing. He's 29 years old, but 67 receptions, 667 yards. And I'm like, not bad. Not bad. So, it's, I'm just kind of like, you know, like I said, I'm in the middle. Like, I would like to him, because right now, I don't believe he signed with anyone. Like, DJ Chalk is a free agent. He's 27. Give him a chance. Check him out. See what he can do. He probably wasn't getting a, a good looking, you know, looking at him. So, that's why I'm kind of like in the middle. Right now, I believe Tyler Boyd, or he that I can think of right off my head, is one of the last good ones. But I don't think he'll come to the Ravens unless he's looking for some money money. But, what y'all think? I'm, I'm just chill with it. I know some people, offensive line and this and that. They possibly already have the offensive line that they like. The draft has a lot of good offensive linemen. They might get one. We don't know. Let's just see what happens. You just got to go with it. I'm, they, I'm like in the middle because I'm like, I'm like y'all need to get some offensive linemen. But it's like you draft these players. I'm thinking like what's well, business-wise, not as a fan-wise. You draft these players. You draft a player like Falele, let's say, or, or Voorhees or whatever. Voorhees hasn't played, so this is going to be his rookie. But there are some offensive linemen that's drafted later on. They just come in, they be good. So possibly they thinking it could be like that for Voorhees. Falele, full time. It can be good for Falele. These are the people we drafted. They are cheaper. 
they need some experience with experience. They can get better. If we bring in multiple offensive linemen, we pretty much just wasted draft picks. That's the only thing I can think of. That's like them, they're going to bring in wide receivers. It's going to be competitions. So they could possibly just be like, hey, this is just going to be a competition year. We got Lamar. We got Derrick Henry. We got Zay Flowers. We got Rowe. We got Simpson next to Rowe. Beautiful. We got Kyle Hamilton. So let's see, y'all. Let's see. Hit the like, hit the subscribe, hit the share. Also, if you want to be entered in the giveaway I'm going to be giving away on draft night. I'm going I'm to do it before the draft because you have to drag it be like three hours. But enter in the comments. Cooking! So I can enter you in there. Everybody hit the like, subscribe, share, and God, stay safe. I'm on a whole different frequency. Yeah. To the point if you met real, you would tell him that he keeps it me. The knob on 11 really turned up. Really turned up. Really turned up. Ride slow through the city while the trunk rattle. No knob on 11, baby, turned up. Be not, let it hit you with the funk.